is welcome back to world illuminator 11 if you are new to the channel a really warm welcome to you so it's the last few days of april start of a new week we're moving into may there's just this excitement that i really feel building up as we move into this new month and it's not just excitement that is my birthday but there's a lot of exciting things that are coming in but i also feel a shift as well in the energy it's like you know there's something there's this anticipation of something coming Coming, you know, because there's been a lot that has been going on since the start of the year and things have been moving forward, you know, and I feel for Divine Masculines as well, it's the same. And they are, as we move more into going towards the second half of the year, you know, things are really shifting. So that's the energy that I feel that's building up. And, you know, and there's this anticipation that is coming in. And, you know, this can be in other areas of your life as well. You know, things moving forward. So what we are going to do for this video, I wanted to face the camera today. I am doing a birthday giveaway. So I've got a couple of items that I'm giving away. And also I wanted to do this as a um, day 22 of our series, Create Magic in Your Life. We're nearly at the end of that series. So day 22. So we're going to start with that part. And do check out the post that I put on the community page because I did talk about a few things that are coming up as well for this um, coming May. But the, the card that we have for day 22 of Create Magic in Your Life is library. This is the one I was guided to. And it says, take control of your own narrative. Oh, wow. I just noticed I hadn't seen. It's number 22 as well. So how really powerful. I hadn't even seen that number. I'm just noticing it now. So it's perfect for this day 22 of the series and this is about taking control of your own narrative taking control of your own life this is about you know not giving your power away remembering that there is no one else to tell you how to live your life you know the things that you may do in your life and you know if, if you are in a situation where someone else is controlling you in one way or another it's time to step away from that and it's time to not let fear control you. You know, you have to take control of your own narrative of your own life. Release that fear that is holding you back from whatever it is that you're wanting to do. Whether you're a divine masculine or a divine feminine. It's time to take control of your own narrative. You know, you have the power within you to live that life that you are truly here to live. You have the power to release fear, to let go of anything and anyone that is holding you back or trying to take control of you, telling you what to do or how to live your life. It's time to take back your own narrative. This is also about being confident, you know, moving forward in your power, going for those things that you are wanting to do, you know, taking that step for that you know that step forward even if it may be a bit scary but you know take that leap of faith go for it it's time to take control of your own narrative really beautiful okay and then the other cards that we've got we've got empowerment which is also a powerful card this is about you being empowered in your life you know, taking control of your own narrative, moving forward. And, you know, and this is about you knowing that you have the power within to do whatever it is that you're wanting to do. You know, you have the power to release whatever or whoever is holding you back. And when you face challenges, you have the power within you to get through those challenges. That's the power that you get as well. And with the help that comes through from your angels, from the creator, helping you as you sort of face those challenges you have the power to go for it and you have that you know this is also about having that confidence you know to get through whatever it is feeling empowered from within to get through whatever it is to take control of your own narrative to move forward to do the things that you're wanting to do so it's about you know finding that power within and knowing you have that power and going for it and not letting anything or anyone hold you back. So it's that empowerment from within. We also have sacred space that has come out here. And sacred space is really about, you know, a place that you sort of have maybe in your home. It can be a little corner or it can be a room where you may have, you know, the things that, you know, whether it's flowers and crystals and, you know, whatever it is that helps you to connect with your, with, with, with spirit, you know, with, with your angels and whatever that sacred space is, that can be the place where you go to meditate, 
you know, that place where you have all the things that, that are important to you. You know, the things that like for me, I've got my little table where I've got like all the feathers that have been given by the angels in all sorts of different places. I've got crystals there, you know, and all sorts of different things. And, you know, or certain books that are important to me. And so, you know, that's that sacred space where you feel that more of that connection is all to your angels. And you can use the space for your meditation, prayer, you know, whatever it is for you. So it's a good place for you to have, you know, to create that space for yourself in, in your, in your, in your house or in your room, somewhere where you just go to feel, you know, to have that time of stillness, to connect with your angels, with spirit, and just have that time for you. You know, it's always a good thing to kind of do that, you know, where you, where you know that when you step into this place, it's, for your own special time, for that connection, and to sort of leave everything else behind. Okay, and that's where you can also be in a place to receive that power that helps you to feel more empowered, you know, and move forward as well in your life. And then from the little book of happiness to finish off, we've got allow yourself to be a child again. And it says, do you remember how things seemed magical when you were a child? Look out for moments of enchantment, courtesy of nature, a rainbow, shimmering raindrops on tree branches, or bird song. Allow yourself to cherish these glimpses of wonder in your heart. So this is about, you know, those times where you see something just beautiful out in nature, like a rainbow, and it's like, it like excites you. It certainly does to me. You know, the same way I would have been excited as a child. I was on the train the other time, and there was a rainbow, and there were these little kids and they were like mommy let rainbow and they were so excited you know just to see it was that sort of enchantment you know of just seeing something magical and beautiful so you're being reminded to get back into that energy you know because it really sort of helps you to feel happier with as well within yourself and then we've got a quote from oscar wilde be yourself everyone else is already taken so this is about you just being yourself everyone else is already taken and you are amazing and special and unique so just be yourself it's about being your true authentic self your empowered self you know that's why it's important to release anything or anyone that tries to take control of your life or to tell you how to live your life and really take that you know take ownership of your own life and how you want your life to go and take steps forward to actually move forward the way you want to go so that's the message for um for day 22 of the series so moving on to the offer uh it's not an offer it's a giveaway I I am doing an offer for um, the the readings that I've talked about as well on the community page, and it's twenty five pounds off, and um, and that's up until eleven May. So you can book up until eleven May. And even if you do have your reading later, but if you've booked it before or on 11 May, then you it will still be £25 uh, less. So, you know, and then from the 12th of May, it goes up. So it's it's the actual booking that goes up until, 20, un, until 11 May for £25 less than it usually is. Um, and then I also talked about, you know, in May, on the 18th of May, Liz from Guided by Angels is doing a first and only um, first face-to-face -face live event in London. So if you're around, do come. It's going to be amazing. You know, you get to spend time with a lot of soul family coming from all over the world. And it's going to be fun. It's going to be focusing on the journey as well, connecting with the angels. And she'll be talking about all that. She's doing um, a, a Q&A as well and all these things. So there's a lot that is happening. So, you know, if you're around in London or if you want to come over, you know, certainly do. I put the details as well or the event the details on the community page. Okay, so the giveaway. So this is my birthday giveaway. So first of all, I am giving away to Ashwini um, a two deck reading and that because you didn't get your your gift at Christmas for for being a moderator. So that is come. Uh, that's that's going to happen. So Ashwini, drop me an email. Um, it's a two deck reading of DM to DF messages, whatever decks I'm guided to, um, or you can choose actually of the decks that you know that I have. 
And uh, so that's the first giveaway for this, for my birthday. And then the second one that I am going to give away, I am also going to give away a three card reading and a three deck reading. And this is a DM to DF as well. So it's just messages from your divine masculine to you, the divine feminine, what they're wanting to say to you. It's going to be a 10 to 15 minute reading. It's just whatever messages that they have for you, you know, 10 to 20 minutes reading, whatever messages that they have for you, what they want you to know, you know. So if you would like to win one of, um, well, that reading, then drop uh, a comment on this video and say why you'd like to win that reading so that's a three deck card reading of uh what your divine masculine would like to say to you and messages that they have for you okay so there's that one and then i'm also giving away this deck here this is the wisdom oracle by colette baron reed and i've got two decks like this and i got this one but it didn't have um the guidebook and you know this is a deck that i really use a lot for myself and, you know, I, and I really wanted to have the guidebook. So I've got two of these now. And so I am giving away this one. It doesn't have a guidebook. It's going to be a deck that you are using your intuition to get whatever messages are coming through for you. However, I also found that there's an online PDF guidebook, which is exactly the same as the guidebook that's, that, you know, that comes in the deck. And, um, and, you know, I can give you a link for that. So if you're wanting to check what the card, uh, the guidebook says about it, then you can use that. So if you've won, if you win this deck, I'll also in, and you email me when I announce the winners, I'll also send you the PDF so that you can check the meanings if you want to, if you want to use the, 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 you know, the guidebook. I tend not to, but for this deck particularly, I wanted to have the guidebook. So, um, you know, it's, you can just use the deck intuitively, get the messages that you're getting. So it's a beautiful deck. It's a really beautiful deck. So if you're wanting to win Wisdom of the Oracle deck by Colette Baron Reed, then drop me, drop a comment as well saying why you'd like to win this. And then to finish off, I am also giving away, this is my, uh, one of my tops. So this is the one that says, let, let your light shine. And this is a large. So, you know, if, if, if it's something that you would like to win, so it's a large and it says, let your light shine and world's illuminator 11. So if you'd like to win this as well, it's brand new. Um, if you'd like to win this, then drop me a, a comment as well to say why you'd like to win that. So. Those are the giveaways that I have. So Ashwini, drop me an email with, um, you know, um, so that we can just talk about your, uh, your two deck reading. Then I'm giving away the three deck card reading, DM to DF messages only. And then I'm giving away this deck, Wisdom of the Oracle. And then also this sweat, sweater or sweatshirt, whatever you call it. Um, and this is the let your light shine and is one of mine. So comment below, say why you would like to win any of these items or even all of the items. And on the 1st of May, so we've got today is the 29th. We've got tomorrow and Tuesday, tomorrow, Tuesday and Wednesday. And then on the 1st, I'm, I'm confused. Anyway, the 1st, whenever the 1st is, that is when I am announcing um, the, the winners. So it will be, so do keep your eye on the channel for an announcement for the winners of these items. They're just my birthday giving away, you know, from, with love from my heart. And, um, and then, you know, let me know as well on that first, or if you can, so that I can get this posted out. You know, I'd like to get things done because I've got a lot going on as well. So if you're wanting to enter, make sure that you watch the video on the first to see if you are a winner. So that's it for today. I hope you have an amazing week and I'm sending you all so much love.